So there is a pretty big iPhone problem going around right now that many people probably don't even know about. And this is actually the battery health issue that is essentially plaguing a lot of different iPhone 14s, 14 Pros, even the 14 Plus and 14 Pro Maxes. Now, I don't really hear too many complaints about the Pro Max or the Pluses, mostly because those batteries are so big that I just don't think that, you know, if, uh, you know, 4,000 million power battery goes down like 500 million powers, you're still going to be like, it's still a lot, but it's not going to be as drastic as a 3,000 million power battery going down 500 million powers. So it's all relative. So that's why I think a lot of the Pro Max and Plus iPhones are still kind of, you know, decent. With the 14 and 14 Pros, these are the ones I'm seeing the most complaints about, probably mostly because they sold the most of these models. But essentially what's going on is that the iPhone 14 and the iPhone 14 Pros are experiencing, in my opinion, massive uneven battery degradation from previous models. When I look at other devices that have came out from Apple, things like the iPhone 11 Pro, the iPhone 12 Pro, the iPhone 13 Pro, even the iPhone 10 and 10s, there are some of uh, some iPhones that stand out more so than others that had, you know, bigger battery degradation than the other models. The iPhone 12 Pro, in my opinion, had uneven battery degradation as well. But for my opinion, the iPhone 11 Pro had pretty even battery degradation. The iPhone 13 Pro had pretty even battery degradation as well. So those types of devices have a lot going for them. When it comes down to the iPhone 14 Pro and the iPhone 14, I have no idea why these iPhones are experiencing these massive amounts of degradation going on for these devices. I would have initially thought it was probably due to some wireless charging thing going on, but it seems like that even that, that isn't even that big of a deal anymore. It looks like that also could be something that may not be as big of a deal as it used to be. So what is going on? Why is this happening? Well, we all know battery degradation happens on every device. So any device out there, you are going to experience some sort of battery degradation one way or another. And I think from that perspective alone, that is going to be a pretty big, I would say, you know, issue going on for all these devices. But I would probably also say that when it comes down to the iPhone 14, how are you going to go ahead and get a device like this that is still going to be, you know, supported for many years, but it's probably going to have a hardware issue coming around sooner than later with that battery. And that's why I still think Apple needs to go ahead and, you know, fix this specific issue. They need to go through and actually address this issue because if they don't, well, then we're going to be stuck with another iPhone series that nobody's going to want to buy because there's just a big battery degradation issue going on with it. So I would love to hear your thoughts about this. Let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, till then.